Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Hallstone Arena with Rel Rob, the Rob. That's me. Uh, we got two wins last uh, episode with our warrior deck. I had some doubts about it, but and it's possible that those doubts are totally reasonable because we are still in the easy, the easy phase of the arena run, where you almost always win the first two matches. Um, we're going to mulligan all of this, because we do not need it. And I'm yawning a lot, I'm sorry. Um, okay, we can coin out a Direwolf Alpha, I guess. If needs be. But we have one or two on one, one cost if we have to do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, greetings. Greetings? Greetings. Okay, so we'll coin out the direwolf. He'll attack it. Probably. And then we can inner rage the, uh, thing, because it will be on one health. Hopefully he doesn't have something to... Oh, there we go. Excellent. And then we'll have the... Oh no! He's going right for the face. Which means we don't even have to inner rage. We just do this. And turn. Well, that was pretty nice. Um, next, mind control deck probably. Well, maybe we should hold that back in case this is like a a rush deck of some sort. What else could we play? Acolyte. Can you do anything apart from that? No. Oh, we can. Shit. Well played. Well played. Well, shit. I guess I'll oh, mind control tech. Um, this is annoying. I'm gonna have. He's gonna have to draw. Although I could kill my own direwolf, which would mean that he could only draw one card off of Acolyte of Pain, which might be nice. I think I'll do that. So, kill him. And now, he has to commit Sepeku to, um, draw any cards. Thank you. Unless I was sarcastic, you bitch. Okay. Uh, Senjin now, I think. Yeah. And let's go for the face. Though maybe I should have not done like maybe it would have been better to get rid of Acolyte in case he's got power over uh, power overwhelming or something. Or anything that can take out Yeah, he's not doing fab, is he? Um well. I could kill the Frost Wolf, Warlord. That's probably what I will do. Execute him. And then. No Mission Venter? Sure. Uh. I don't know, should I be taking out his Acolyte? Nah, screw it, go for the face. Make him. Ha make him do it. It'll mean he gets the card draw one turn later. Ah, shit. Oh, drat. Made a mistake there, then. Faceless manipulator. Kind of useless right now. I guess Venture Co. is probably what we want to do. I mean, when the Venture Co. is dead, we'll have turn 9, 8 damage, and also 3 free damage, essentially. So... If we can attack him once, we'll win. I imagine. Okay. Um, and let's take out Questing Adventure before it becomes too strong. And actually, we kind of need... Oh no, do we? 
if we attack, we'll be one too little to kill him with the night blade next turn, or he'll have he'll be on one health essentially. Wait, no, we can just Corcoran Lee, which will kill him. So we've got the victory next turn, unless he manages to kill the Venture Co. Oh no, we don't anymore. My eyes are open. Shit, man. He's healing himself up. But he's not going for the Venture Co. Interesting. If only that had charge. Um, or if only I'd picked the charge card. Oh well. So if I go for the fresh, I could grab another Venture <laughs> mercenary. Actually, could he kill me next turn? He's got 8 damage. Six. Uh, he's got 14, so we don't have to do 6 more damage. Yeah, we should probably take something out. Uh, so I'll do that. And then I'll summon Corcoran Elite. Sure, Corcoran Elite. Just go for the face. See what he does. We removed eight damage from him, so that was his his big heavy hitter. We can deal. Oh, he got the win next turn. Unless he kills me, which he must be able to do, because he didn't attack either of my guys or heal himself. Yeah. Okay. I can still deal eight damage though. Fact. Is eight damage the most? Yeah, eight damage is the most I can deal. So I'll do that. And then I can win pretty easily next turn. Thanks. thanks. Does he have some way of winning? Well played. He does not. It would seem. Unless he's got another Shadow Flame, which is possible. Or fucking Lord Jaraxxus. That would be uh, incredibly annoying. Come on, what you got? Core Hound. That's not going to do shit unless he can uh, <laughs> kill himself. No, he doesn't. Oh, he thinks he actually might still be able to win. <laughs> um, come on, give it. There we are. Any any of the cards in our hand would have given us the win there. Well played. Victory. Okay, third win. Now we get into the uh, the sort of area where I start losing quite a bit. So hopefully we're going to keep moving, moving on up. But you know, sometimes I do get stuck here. Okay, Jaina, Dave Garfield. You asked for it. We keep getting direwolf alphas in our first hand. Um, keep everything apart from the ancient brewmaster. Yeah, oh, maybe I should have kept the ancient brewmaster. Um, well, <clears throat> what do I want to do? Be really nice if we got a turn. If we got a one mana cost card. Shit. That's just bad, man. Fuck. Um, okay, maybe I should Heroic Strike. Take it out before it becomes a problem. I can bring out the Direwolf Elf for next turn. Then. The Shatter Sun Cleric after that, maybe? Or Demolish Shell, we'll see what it's like. See what's going on. What the board looks like at that point. Okay, that's kind of annoying, but nothing too big. Um, we'll go to the Direwolf Alpha, Job done. and then, ugh, I don't know, Demolisher, I guess. Ah, hug. Um, right, Demolisher, I suppose, is the thing. No, Acolyte, go the Acolyte. Take, take the knife juggler out because 
That card is a pain in the ass. Uh, so Shadows and Cleric on uh, Acolyte of Pain would be quite nice, I think. I still can't take either of his things out there, which is kind of annoying. So maybe I should just go for the face and hope he sends out a bunch. <laughs> hope he sends out two more minions and I can steal one. Oh no! I should have. Fuck! Shattered Sun Cleric is gonna probably get killed by that. The uh, gnome ish inventor. Um. All right. Hmm. Probably won't be taking out the Acolyte of Pain, though. So that's something. Fuck. Silence, Polymorph. What's she got? Fireball. Fireball. Well, I draw one card at least. Corcoran Elite. <clears throat> okay. Spiteful Smith. Um. Sure. We might draw a weapon in a couple of turns and then be pretty useful. And it's a reasonable card. Its stats is pretty good for the uh, mana cost as well. I wonder. Uh, okay. Vaporize, possibly. Kind of sort of tell what it may be. She's really uh, taking me down, isn't she? Ugh. I mean, Demolisher? I guess. Shit. Okay, at least I can take it out. Wait. Now. Oh, that's brilliant, actually. What am I going to get? Cool. Take him out. And we really turn that around. That's nice. And hopefully we'll draw a weapon of some sort. What we Fuck. <laughs> okay, so that'll take out most of what I've got. Wait, no, it only does two damage, doesn't it? Is he going to ping it for some weird reason? <laughs> okay, whatever. Anyway, deal two damage to all characters. What to do? So, what to do? depending on who he attacks this turn... Really? That's quite weird. So, I can... Arcanite Reaper... Uh, this is annoying, actually. Okay, I'll charge... I'll bring out. Well, I'll wait a turn and bring six fuel. Well, wait until after this guy kind of blows up. I'll do this. And then I will do that. And that. And that. And next turn, hopefully, as long as the, the uh, spiteful smith is still alive, I'll bring out a seven Arcanite Reaper. And that would win me the game if he doesn't kill anything but he's definitely going to kill something Put this apple on your head. ugh knife juggler you bitch oh no oh oopsie she made a mistake and now I can do this and that and I'll armor up and go for the face and then, then what do I want to do? Just smash her in the face a bit more? Yeah, because even if uh, I lose the Spiteful Smith, I'll still have enough to take her out with the Arcanite Reaper. Can you do anything, love? To me, I don't feel like you can. Yeah, she's... Pulling for something. I don't know what she could do with two. Freeze me, I guess. What you want. Oh, we'll taunt. Okay, yeah. That's something. Except. Shit. Um. 
Okay, I guess I gotta do this. Do that. I mean, just get as much stuff out as possible. Eventually, we kill it, and Arathi and the weapon will kill it. So, as long as she can't take out both of them, I'll be alright. Flame Strike would do me. Fuck. Six Swamp Crews would do me. Fucking Fireball, man. Jesus. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Not good, not good. Okay. Nightblade. Nightblade? Over Boulder Fist? They're both sort of the same. Boulder Fist is probably the better thing to do though. Because he'll have, she'll have, or he or she, he, I guess. She, it's not, probably not a woman called Dave. But he'll have to send both of the, um, things into the Bold Fist Ogre to deal with it, whereas they would have only had to send the, um, Azure Drake into the Nightblade and would have kept the Acidic Swampoos. But now, as long as I get, uh, pretty much any weapon, I'll be alright. So this is kind of close. I'm basically just waiting to draw something that will give me the win. Um, so anything on the board will win it for me, of course. She can't take out uh, both of them with what she's got in the field. It all depends on what's in her hand. Does she have it? Hmm. Your magic shall not Science. That won't that won't save you. Is that it? It looks like it might be. Yep. Well played. Good. <clears throat> Four wins. That's pretty nice. Okay, so thank you for watching. I've been Rob, and uh, I'll see you next time on Hearthstone Arena. Tune in. Bye bye.